Mine and Lizzie's relationship started in 2018, but we actually first met in 2014. Zanti, 2014, lads on tour. <laughs> By pure coincidence, a group of girls from Sunderland who were also in Zanti at the same time. Lizzie was part of that group. Mutual friends meant we endured a very awkward meetup. Having went to an all-boys school for the last seven years, it was a real struggle. I would be lying if I said it was love at first sight. Lizzie, in those days, was transitioning between her emo fears and her mod fears, like a hybrid of Paul Weller and Marilyn Manson. <laughs> Fast forward to 2018, we became reacquainted. This wasn't the same Lizzie I'd met in Greece. Peter and Elizabeth, today you stand on a threshold of a lifetime of dreams and hopes for love has brought you to this place and on behalf of all of us all of the people who love you can i say what a huge privilege it is to join with you today in the celebration of your marriage 5th of may 2018 i was working the late night shift in the terrace with kieran my best man here to be honest, it wasn't much of a job, just two mates messing around and occasionally serving pints and horrific cocktails. Then something happened. A half-cut Lizzie acquired my number through our mutual friend Megan. Myself and Kieran shared a celebratory handshake. I pulled. What a legend. <laughs> Peter, will you take Elizabeth to be your wife? Will you love her, comfort her, honour and protect her, and forsaking all others, be faithful to her as long as you both shall live? I will. Elizabeth, will you take Peter to be your husband? Will you love him, comfort him, honour and protect him, and forsaking all others, be faithful to him as long as you both shall live? We exchanged texts for about a week and quickly found we held a lot of mutual interests. Both studied history at university. I graduated with a 2-1 from Northumbria. Lizzie with a first from Newcastle. A huge power play from Lizzie at early doors. <laughs> Me and Lizzie went from strength to strength and I think it's fair to say that we knew we had something special right away. In the presence of God and before this congregation, Peter and Elizabeth have given their consent and made their marriage vows to each other. They have declared their marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore proclaim they are husband and wife. We really aren't into sorry displays of public affection, but I did want to say how proud I am to be your husband. You make everything around you better. I am in awe of your kindness, hard work in nature, and your beauty. I really am one lucky guy, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. So on that note, I'd like to raise a toast to my beautiful wife, Elizabeth. Cheers.
Many people say that your wedding day should be the happiest day of your life. Well, I hope it's a wonderful day. I hope it's a joyous day, but I hope it isn't the happiest day. Because wouldn't it be sad if today it all ended? This is just the beginning, the future of your life as Mr. and Mrs.